Welcome to my channel. My name is Wizzy Pacheco. So let me go ahead and do this video. The title of this video is The Sixth Agreement Continued. Or however you want to. Um, yeah, I'm going to talk about that sixth. So, so the thing is, right, that um, as I'm always saying on my channel, I'm a really big fan of this, the, Mex the Mexican author, his name is Miguel Ruiz. And you know, and I always talk about how I enjoy uh, reading those books so much because it, you know, the, by reading all that information, I was able to like comprehend better what, what life really is. Because from a Toltec point of view, like we're just dreaming. And it's so, to, to me, that's such a, I don't even know how to say it, it's such a wonderful description of what life is. For the simple fact that, like, a lot of shit we don't remember. Like, I always talk about this. Like, literally, if you ask someone about their, you know, they, like, I, I like the way that Miguel Ruiz explains it in his books. And I always say the same thing. It's like, if you ask someone if they remember whenever they were, like, 10 or 12 years old at most <clears throat> we'll probably remember like five percent of the shit that of the past just because that's how life is that that's how dreams are we just we tend to forget all the shit that we that we live like sometimes oh man this shit is crazy like shit really is really fucking crazy man i just i was um i just watched uh, the cold the, the uh, latest Cole Robinson video, and man, that, just watching Cole talk about the last, you know, the last thing that he was talking that he was talking about drinking water. I don't know, just just watching Cole, um, you know, do these, um, just watching him do what he does, just inspires me even more to, to, to you know, to keep going. Cause this shit is, oh man, life is so fucking weird, man. Life is really just. Life is so fucking weird, man. It's fucking crazy. But anyhow, so you know how whenever, um, so you know how the Walt Disney um, person talks about how if you can imagine it, you, you can create it? Kind of like that, man. Like the, you know that, you know how there's, okay, so the thing is that there's five Toltec agreements, right? You know, I, I always talk about the agreements because I'm always constantly... Like, you can... The other day, I was trying to say how, like, it just becomes automatic. Like, I already know. Like, I've been practicing the agreements for such a long time that it gets to a point where it just becomes automatic, right? Like, you, you know, to... You know, just... You know, the five uh, agreements that are established, which is, you know, I'm always talking about the, you know, the, for the most important one is to be impeccable with the word. Cause it is, man. You, we, we really are what we say. Like whatever you say, that's you. And you know, and like, like Stone Cold, um, you know, used to say. Bottom line, whenever you're impeccable with your word, like that's like the most important one. And then of course, you know, we should never. There's no fucking reason why anyone should take anything personal. And if you really look at like society, it's just funny. Like it becomes. It, like I, I read the books in Spanish, and it it says it, it it says it becomes funny, it becomes comic, it becomes comical when you watch what other people do. Like this shit's just fucking hilarious. Like, oh man, I'm gonna big shout outs to Sarah Safari. Like I'm literally about to go on a meal bus. Like the, they have these blue uh, buses here in Cali, and uh, people um, or you know. So I I'm thinking about buying um, actually with my homeboy. We're probably gonna head on the uh, on the buses, and we're gonna make money. <laughs> I mean, it's just fucking retarded, man. I, oh man, sometimes I don't even know how to express myself because shit is just so fucking weird. But I, I feel really good though, and um, yeah, man. Oh, so what I wanted to talk about was that six. Um, so I'm probably gonna end up. I don't even know what the fuck to do, man. This shit's so crazy. Of course, I'm gonna start working, and uh. <laughs> I need to, I, you know, I really, I'm, I'm really looking forward to buying these, uh, I want to buy a, a box of chocolates. And I want to, 
and I want to send that um, and I want to send out those uh, those char I want to send those chocolates out to Sarah Safari because I really I, I have a so I have to admit I have a gigantic crush on Sarah Safari so I wanna um I wanna I wanna send Sarah Safari a box of chocolates so I um I would actually I'm gonna try to find the address so so I can send it to her and I'm gonna send it as a uh, an anonymous gift. Like I really, I'm not trying to get, um, how do you say it? Like I'm not trying to, uh, like you, I'm not looking for recognition or anything like that. I just, you know, I just, you know, I don't know. I, I just wanna, um, I don't know. I wanna uh, show my appreciation towards uh, Sarah Safari. So I wanna, um, so I'm gonna try to sell these, uh, these, uh, what do you call it? It's kind of like uh, candlesticks, uh, scent, um, What's it called in English? The the scent. It's like these little uh, scent sticks. They, you know, people over here sell them. So uh, I was thinking about doing that, and <laughs> you know, just to, um, cause I wanna uh, I wanna send Sarah Safari a box of chocolates. <laughs> just like for you know, like Forrest Gump used to used to say in the movie that life is just like a box. It really is, man. Life is like a fucking box of chocolates. You never know what the fuck. Is gonna happen. Shit is crazy weird. And um, so the other thing I was gonna talk about was that six agreement thing. So you know how the Walt Disney guy would say like, uh, if you can imagine it, you can create it. Shit like that, man. I like I think about so much crazy shit that it's just fucking crazy, man. But the point is that the whenever you practice the six agreement, it's basically recognizing your own power. Because the human beings are the most powerful fucking animal that exists on the planet. You know how they have the food chain? Well, why do you think we're on top of the food chain? Because we, human beings can eat whatever the fuck, and you know, we want. And that's you know that's exactly why we're we're on top of the food chain. And uh, was that, oh yeah, so whenever you recognize your own power. You become invincible, like that's the sixth agreement is you cannot be the, like, think about like an MMA fighter, like Conor McGregor. You think when Conor McGregor, let's say he loses a fight, he knows that whenever he wakes up the next day, it's a fresh new start. Like no matter how many times you've been beaten, you, you, no matter how many losses you've taken, tomorrow is a new beginning. Like life is literally just a dream. So whenever you're conscient that you know what I'm saying? Now tomorrow is a new beginning. Like you, you're well aware that you're invincible. That there's no way that you can be defeated. Whenever you recognize that power that we all have, like that shit, man. Like you, you we're so powerful. We can cure ourselves from fucking anything. And once you recognize that, and you actually have faith in your, you know, put all the faith in your, in, in yourself, because that's. That's actually what faith really is. It's just believing ourselves, believing, you know, ourselves. That's what faith really is. So I don't know, man. I'm gonna, um, it's just fucking crazy, man. Just everything is fucking, it's so weird and so crazy. But I, I actually feel really good, man. I, I feel, I feel that, oh man, like I, okay, so I'm gonna talk about something else. So I'm, so today I was looking at this guy, man, and like, Shit, man, I really do wanna, I, I wanna figure out, I'm, like, I'm trying to figure out how to make a lot of, like, I'm trying to, there's a lot of things on my mind, like, I wanna start food businesses, I wanna start all sorts of shit, just cause I wanna make a lot of money, like, I, oh, I wanna buy Sarah Safari or that green Porsche, that, you know, there's this, there's this picture that Sarah Safari took, and, um, and she was next to this green Porsche, like, I wanna, um, like, I, I would, I, I want to buy her that car, and of course, you know, one of those Porsches is probably like what, like, like fifty grand or something. So I, you know, I'm trying to make it. I'm trying to do all I can to um, where I'm. I don't even know how to. Oh, this it's so fucking weird, man. A lot of times I don't like I trying to find words to express what I want to say. So I want to do all these things to make a lot of money, and uh, and yeah. So I'm probably gonna start off with like a small food business. And then um, there's just a lot of shit that I have in mind. So right, I'm gonna go ahead. And I'm gonna upload this video. I just wanted to say a few things, and uh, thanks, 
to everyone for watching and I, I hope everyone has an amazing rest of your day.